Welcome back to Nest Studios. I'm your host, Bertendo. Please don't forget to do this after today's video. And now we pan down to our beautiful collection. Let me ask you a question. Are you ready for a big video? Since we're just around the corner for the holidays, and since my paycheck was pretty, pretty fat. Fusion Strike, a two-pack box with Vaporeon, with a Vaporeon GX10 and a Quick Ball, are the main culprits. But let's calm down on the meat and potatoes and finish our veggies. So we got three packs of Fusion Strike, and we got this new first partner pack with the Kanto starters, the original Kanto starters. We'll save that for later. Let's make it a first time on YouTube that Bird Tendo will be opening this three pack of Fusion Strike up here and dig into some new Fusion style, huh? Let me pause the recording. Today's a big day. Let's do this. Okay, so everything is out. We got two Mew pack arts and we also got Genesect here as well too. Let's do the sect in the middle and then we'll go with the two Mews right there. Hold on. So a new thing they're doing with these codes is that they're making the borders all white. So if it's a white border like we got here, we're pretty much getting nothing really. But if it's black border, then we get something. So you can go ahead and take that code for yourself. I already did open it up on the TCGO and so far I didn't really get anything nice from there. So you can have that for yourself, and here we go. Electric type energy, Hariyama, Breloom, Cross Switcher, our very first fusion strike card, Meltan, Mawile, Makihita, Panpour, Sewaddle, Reverse Holographic, Chili, Ensulon, and Cress, and Electros Regular Rare. A nice little start there. We got two fusion cards from that set. I've been getting a lot of single and rapid striker strikers right there as well too, so that's pretty cool. Let's uh, let's see here. Mew's a pretty good boy. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Catch a tiger by its toe. If it hollers, let it go. You. We'll go with you, Mew. We'll save you, Mew, for later. Hold well on. It's a white border, unfortunately. Fun fact: Mew is actually my father's favorite Pokemon. So you can go ahead and take that code right there. Let's do this. We got a grass type energy. Skaters Park. This is a nice trainer. Whenever either player's active Pokemon retreats, put any basic energy that will be discarded in their hand instead of the discard pile. So all energy goes into your hand instead. Frost Moth. We got Nine Tails. Galarian Darumaka. Sizzlipede. Stuffle. Sandy Gast. Blessel. Airverse Holographic Indity. And a Kangaskhan regular rare. You know, something they ought to do is to take some of these rapid strike and single strike cards and do a reverse switch on them. Like make Kangaskhan a single strike and and make the aforementioned Sizzlipede a, uh, a, a single strike as well too. And make Hariyama a rapid strike as well. So let's move on with our final Mew and we'll see what we can get in. This is a surprise. There is not even a code in this. Not even a code. I think someone forgot to package it, but we got something nice on the back. Must be worth the uh, exclusion. Fire-type energy. Victini. Hey, brings victory. E-Electric. Dunsparce. Clam Pearl. More Pico. Skarmory. Sashelmet. Plessel. Airverse Holographic. Senescorch. And a full art Hoopa V. Beautiful. Look at that pattern. For a dark type Pokemon, that is absolutely wonderful. It's a, It must be a theme to give all these ferocious, spooky Pokemon some really, really vibrant backgrounds. Like, it's just so wonderful. The ability to face... As long as this Pokemon is in play, it is Psychic and Dark type. And for two Dark and a Colorless, Shadow Impact for 170. Put three damage counters on one of your Pokemon. That's our very first Fusion Strike Full Art and our very first pull from this set. Wonderful, man. Well, I mean, 
well, it's, it didn't really treat me all that well on a TCGO, but at least we got Hoopa. Greedy for treasure, greedy for a lot of good stuff. Now it's time to train on with the Kanto boys. Let's get them out and see what other friends we can get for our full art Hoopa V. Hold on. Everything is out. Our packs are Darkness Ablaze and Evolving Skies. But first, let's have a look at these big cards. Original cards, that is. We got Bulbasaur here with 40 HP. For 2 Grass, Leech Seed for 20. Unless all damage from this attack is prevented, you may remove 1 damage counter from Venusaur. Charmander with 50 HP. For 1 Colorless, Scratch for 10. And for 1 Fire and a Colorless, Ember for 30. Discard 1 Fire Energy card. Attach Charmander, excuse me, in order to use this attack. Now it's Squirtle time. For one water, bubble for ten. Flip a coin of heads, and Fang Pokemon is now paralyzed. And for one water and colorless, withdraw. Flip a coin of heads, prevent all damage on a squirrel during your opponent's next turn. Yeah, a lot of these cards are pretty wordy. But the real OG are their uh, final Evos. I do have Venusaur. I have the Venusaur Hollow, which is nice. But enough about that. Let's do Darkness Ablaze first with Eternatus on the front, and we'll move on with Evolving Skies. Here we go. You know, it's still pretty strange that that Final Fusion Strike pack did not give us a code, unfortunately, but that's okay. You can go ahead and take that code for yourself. It's green. So we got Grass-type Energy, Gotharita, Fletchender, Hiding Darkness Energy, Rowlet, Skitty, we got Taxel, Morilol, Larvesta, Airverse Holographic, Pansage, and unfortunately this is a, it was a green code, but we got a Holographic Suicune. Suicune's a very bulky boy. Pretty bulky, pretty good. Wow, a lot of these codes are lying to me. Wish they'd do that more often, really. Alright, let's move on with Evolving Skies. It's been a really nice set to me so far. I mean, a full art Rayquaza V, a Secret Art VMAX with Rayquaza and Leafeon, and a Rainbow Zinnia. I wonder what else we can get from here. wonder what else with Sylveon here. It's been pull after pull after pull so far, and there is something glittering on the back. Here we go. We got Grass-type Energy, Snow Leaf Badge, Gordy, Dragon-type Zuelis, Lilypup, Bagon, Litleo, Lotad, Teddy Ursa, Airverse Holographic Raihan, and a Full Art Zinnia's Resolve to go with the Rainbow Zinnia's Resolve. I have already read what this card did. If you want, you can check out the, one of the videos where I opened up three packs of Evolving Skies. I believe it's either the Jackpot one, or it's probably the one after. I'll probably send a link into the description. The cut is a little off, but you know what? That's awesome that we got a full art Zinnia to go with our Rainbow Zinnia. Which is my very first Rainbow Trainer. Which is pretty neat. So, Hoopa's got a friend in need. Or whatever that goes in Toy Story. It's a nice film. Pretty good film. So, so far, so good. We got three pulls from uh, two products. Uh, let's see. We'll save uh, Fusion Strike for later. Let's go with the uh, Quick Ball and Vaporeon GX 10 right there. Which is apparently a very popular card. Let me get this bad boy out. It's like Christmas has came a little early for me. Although I did for me myself. So we'll leave the Vaporeon 10 for later, and we'll get out this Quick Ball, and we'll quickly see what's inside of this boy. Okay, there's our beautiful little Quick Ball right here. I remember catching a Rayquaza on Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire during the Delta episode in this bad boy. Our little coin we got is a Solgaleo, a tiny little Solgaleo coin, which is very small. Very, very small. We got Breakthrough, Burning Shadows, and Crimson Invasion. These ball tins always give me a ton of luck. The very first ball tin I opened up, which is the Pokeball tin, got me a Rainbow Kartana. I opened up an Ultra Ball tin, and it gave me a Full Art Buzzwole, and a, the recent one I opened up, a Dive Ball tin. Oh man, I got Rainbow Noivern. Spoilers, go check it for yourself. I mean, okay. Let's open up Breakthrough, and I believe with these codes, it doesn't really matter, so let's just dive in. There's the code. Go ahead and take it. It's yours. We got a Giovanni Scheme, Ursaring, 
Fisherman, Chespin. I started my collection with X and Y, which is awesome. Roaring Skies, Noibat, Piplup, Chespin again, Bronzor, Reverse Holographic Heavy Boots, and a Mammoth Swine Holographic. That's wonderful. He's alright. He's okay in Pokemon Go. He's a bit of a glass cannon. Sure, he hits hard, but he dies easy. I mean, Ice and Ground is not really a good defensive typing. Top of any time with Burning Shadows. I got Top of Coco. I got a Rainbow Lele. I got Bulu. Hoping I get Finny. Probably won't happen. That's okay. Let's just get it out. The code is yours. Take it. It's green. Here we go. So we got Water Type Energy, Bodybuilding Dumbbells, Simipore, Soul Rock, Alolan Grimer, Riolu, Kitty Fly, Zupider, Togedemaru, Reverse All Graphic Acerola, and we got a Malamar Regular Rare. Nothing new from there. No Finny, but that's okay. It's not like I'm hunting for it. I think the card kind of sucks. Grimson Invasion Time with Buzzwool. Ultra Beasts, man. Remember them? I don't even... I haven't seen them on the uh, cards as of yet. Let's just get them out. So this uh, Quick Ball tin was not as, exci as exciting. We only got a Mammoth Swine Hollow from that, so just take the code. So we got Psychic Type Energy, Counter Energy, Mill Tank, Zwaylis, Mankey, Cubone, Execute, Magikarp, Mancino, Reverse Holographic Skiddo, and Octillery Regular Rare. Look at that thing. Look at him. Okay, that's enough of that quick ball stuff. You know, if you go fast in life, you're going to probably get very little, so it's best to take it slow. So, now it's time for Vapors. I got a friend on Twitter who loves Vaporeon. This one's for you, buddy. Here we go. Okay, everything is out, and here's our Vaporeon GX. I'm probably going to keep the code for the TCGO because... Well, if you want to see Vaporeon in action, you can catch me live on Twitch. And I know what you're thinking. Bertendo, are you a scalper buying all this stuff? What are you thinking? First, I resent you calling me a scalper. I'm not a scalper. I'm a collector. I collect. I don't trade much. On, I battle. I battle and I trade on online. I collect both online and real life. So, let's read what Vaporeon does. The ability, Hydrating Drops. Once during your turn before you attack, you may heal 30 damage from your active Watermon. For 3 colorless, Hydro Pump for 40 plus. It'll do 30 more damage times the amount of water energy attached to this Pokemon. And for a single water energy, Cure Shower GX. Heal all damage from all of your water Pokemon. Works pretty well for a water type deck. I'm going to keep it for myself. Let me just uh, organize my stuff here. Probably push the good pulls right there and I'll put Vaporeon right there. And now it's time for Volcanion from Steam Sage. Steam Sage and Burning Shadows were sticking it together. Anyway, here we go. It's a white code. You can go ahead and take it. We got a hollow on the back. We got a dual type shiny Azumarill. Remember when people used to do that card? It was a, it was a one time thing. Duot, Fletchender, Mankey, Shellos, Dino, Larvesta, Apom, Air Versus Holographic Klefki, and a dual type shiny Bisharp Holographic. Nothing really special about those cards, to be honest with you. Those dual-type shinies. Sure, it makes gameplay a little bit better, but... Man, oh man. At least make them secret rares. We'll probably go after them. Top of any time with Burning Shadows. Here we go. We got another white coat and something nice on the back. Here we go. Fire-type energy. Semipor. Rotom Dex. Pokefinder mode. Potown. Sandy Gast. Rhyhorn. Meryl, Caterpie, Mori Lull, Air vs. Holographic Poe Town, and a Full Art Marshadow GX, which I already have. That's still pretty cool. Still pretty neat. I already have the card, but that's awesome, man. You can still go there. He's still my boy. Now, if that was a Rainbow Charizard, well, that's just me counting my chickens before they hatch. Crimson Invasion Time with Kartana. So I got the Full Art and I got the Rainbow Print. I'm still awaiting on the regular print. I don't really care. Let's just get into it. Yet another white coat and yet something nice. This Vaporeon 10's been nice to me. We got Electric Type Energy, Pile of Swine, Peking Red Card, Mill Tank, Mancino, Corpish, Ghastly, Aeron, Dano, Reverse Holographic Execute, and Alolan Golem GX. Oh yes, Alolan forms in Generation 7 were wonderful. 
Alolan Golem was a little strange. I mean, rock electric, not ground electric like Stunfisk. I'm not hating. I like it. For one lightning and two colorless, hammer in for 80. And for two lightning and two colorless, super electromagnetic tackle <gasps> for 200 and it does 50 damage to itself. And for the same amount, Heavy Rock GX for 100, your opponent can't play any cards from their hand during their next turn. That's a good limiter right there. That was before the Horror House GX Gengar and Mimikyu. Okay, now it's time for Forbidden Light. I didn't open up much of this set, to be honest with you. I don't recall any uh, pulling any good cards from that set. But let's just get into it, man. And we unfortunately close out with a green code. Which sucks. And yeah, Prison Stars are actually in this set. I don't think I see one. Fire-type energy. Bonnie from X and Y. Gabite. Tyrant. Clauncher. Gibble. Flabebe. Froki. Crow Gunk, Air Versus All Graphic Binacle, and an Alolan Marowak Regular Rare. These Alolan cards usually have a free attack. Unfortunately, I guess Alolan Golem was a bit of a um, exception. But we still did pretty good. We got, what, Marshadow GX, Full Art, and Alolan Golem? That was pretty good. Man, Vaporeon treated me very well. I was eating, I was eating perfectly. Good for you. Good for you, Vapors. Once you rest in the back while we bring out the Holy Trinity, that is, the Fusion Strike Elite Trainer Box. This is what I'm going to be saving for last. Let me get this place cleaned up. Take a breather. Here we go. My goodness, everything is out and it's starting to look like a mess, I know. I'm a little unorganized. This was a workout to get out of here. That's a wonderful, cute little Mew. A cute little Mew. In that little box with nice little circle patterns. Let's have a gander at the Holy Bible that is Fusion Strike. It's a giant set. There's Mew. Pardon my finger, sorry. You got new cards here, man. Tons of new cards that are coming out. Seriously, pardon my finger. What's going on with it? We got Breloom V, Serena V, Rillaboom got a new V Max. S Cinderace got two cards, unfortunately, and. A Gigantamax card that kind of sucks. Inteleon VMAX is a big Timmy O tool. It's wonderful. I love it. All these wonderful cards. Dodrio V, man. Dodrio V's here. That's the hoopla I just pulled. All these wonderful cards you can get, man. All these wonderful cards you can get from this set. It is, it is indeed wonderful. Absolutely huge. Very, very big set. There's Gengar V and his VMAX being single strike style. They deserve it. And a new Tyrantar V, which is a little okay. A little okay. There's Yafeltal right there. Dragons. That Gudra is something I do not like. And I do not want to... Now we're in the big stuff here. We got a Secret Art Celebi V there. There's a Secret Art Mew V everyone's going after. There's Genesec pulling off some moves. Sanaconda Vibin. Like a cat entering its loaf position. Greedent V. The long names of those three guys. That cute little dancer with the belly. All the secret arts. Espeon V Max. Shiny Fluffy. And they're doing the secret art er the secret energies as well, too. Nothing really to skim past about. Let's let's get into her. Take the online code card for yourself. It's yours. Go for it, man. I'll move it out of the way. This is how we're gonna finish, man. With Fusion Strike. Let's get these packs shoveled up. And let's see what's in. Okay. The packs are shuffled. We're gonna go with Mew. Little Mew. Makes her dreams come true. Well, actually Jirachi. But you know what? Mew can probably do the same as well. Gave us a full art Hoopa V. So good for him. It's unfortunately a white border. But you can go ahead and take it for yourself. We got a Psychic Type Energy. Senna Scorch. Uncommon. Okay. Bug Catcher, Fusion Strike Energy, Caterpie, Drillbur, Shinx, Baneri, Basculin, Air Versus All Graphic Q Fit, and there's our Yafeltal, regular rare, with single strike wings. Very, very strong boy indeed. Gotta love single strike, man. Let's go with Gengar, Gigantamax Gengar. 
Of course he gets a new form. They say if you enter his mouth, you can hear your loved ones calling out for you. And it goes into the afterlife. They're going for new things with this boy, I'm telling you. It's been white border palooza so far, but you can take the code for yourself. We got a darkness type energy. Mag cargo. Dub wool. Spongy gloves. Pantsir. Dragon type Gumi. Aracuda. Snubble. Geodude. Air vs. Holographic Vulpix, and a Goribus Regular Rare. That's okay. It's all good, man. It's all good. Time for Genesect. Let's do this. Okay, just want to show off the code I just got. It's a black border. That's what they look like. Nothing surprising. We got, I think we got a hollow on the back. Here we go. Lightning type energy. Barrascuta. Caparaja. Cook. It's a new Pokemon Center Lady, pretty much. Baneri. Basculin, uh, we got Grubbin, Mankey, Krogunk, Air vs. Holographic Sligoo, and a Holographic Galarian Obstagoon with Merciless Strike and Silence. Be quiet. Not you guys. You guys can talk all you want. Look at all these, look at all this, man. All these cards, and that's all the rares I got. Time for Gengar! Our good ghost boy who goes very fast and is a loose cannon. I'm sorry, a loose glass cannon. Here we go. It's a white border, unfortunately, but that's okay. We got fire type energy. Galarian Linoon. Stantler. Gliscor. Galarian Darumaka. Indidi. Growlithe. Lynx. Morpico. Air vs. All Graphic Battle VIP Pass. And a Verizion Regular Rare. Eh. So far, nothing from here, but you know what? At least we got a lot of pulls today. A lot of good pulls and full art Hoopa V, which is also pretty cool as well. Car cards are sliding off. I have so many. Here we go from you. Here we go. Another white border, unfortunately. That's all right. We got a grass type energy. Frostmoth, Simiseer, Farewell Bell, Growlithe, Stuffle. Sigilith, Taxel, Totodile, Airverse Holographic Breloom, and a Latios Regular Rare. Fusion Strike Style. Dragon type as well, too. We got two packs left. Man, oh man, we did pretty good. Let's go, Genesect, and we'll save Bolt Time for last. Here we go. We got a black border, and we got something nice on the back. Here we go. We got a Steel Type Energy, Frostmoth, Simiseer, Farewell Bell. Sizzlepede, Klefki, Pansage, Wulu, Pancham, a Reverse Holographic, Snum, and a Rapid Strike, Rillaboom V. A whole lot better than the Rebel Clash version of him. For one grass and two colorless, Drain Punch for 60. Heal 30 damage from this Pokemon. And for one grass and three colorless, Drum Rush for 160. Sweet, our second pull from Fusion Strike. It's been all right with me. It's been a good boy to us. Now it doesn't really matter what we pull out of this. At least we got a nice little audience of ultra rares to greet whoever's going to come out of this Bolton pack. Here we go. The little girl's singing. Let me show off the poster real quick. I forgot to show that off. There's Mew, Gengar, Bolton, Genesect. Here we go. It's another black border. It's probably another hollow. If you've been this far in this video, thank you. Actually, thank you. Oh my goodness, thank you. We got Water Type Energy, close out. Galarian Linoon, Stantler, Gliscor, Baneri, Clobopus, Tynamo, Zora, Shelter, Airverse, Holographic Snubble to close out, and Toxtricity, regular rare. I mean, holographic, holographic rare. Wonderful. We finally went through the whole Palooza. I think I'm going insane, but you know what? I feel like a kid now, man. I feel like a young boy who woke up on Christmas morning and found out that there's a lot of good stuff here. Even though it's still November and we're all talking about the holidays, I guess, I guess it's a corporate thing, to be honest with you. But let's see, man. We got one. We got two. Three, I'm probably not going to count in Vaporeon because it's a promo. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twen
five, six, seven, eight, a whopping 10 pulls. 10 pulls from all those products that I got. Man, oh man, oh man, was that beautiful. And as beautiful as this wonderful set is, that's unfortunately the end of our video. Our very long 25 minute video. I remember doing big videos like this. Always getting tons of views. At least on my old channel. But that's unfortunately it. If you enjoy this little journey, like, comment, and subscribe. This has been S Studios Production. I'm your host, Bird Tendo. Peace.